Hello, everybody, and welcome Hello, back. Hello, everybody. Oh. Really? So let's read. <laughs> God damn it. Let's read. Three of me, school society. Three I'm joined, as let's always, society. by, uh, by Nerho. Or Nevo, as the title card says. That's an R. And Zombie Zom. Zombie Zom is my full name. And uh, uh, Time Knight's on vacation. So, yeah. and uh, G Money the a plane left. left for dead. Yeah, so you're, you're, you're G stuck Money left for side. dead. So you're, the you're stuck with, with the, um, the other better A team for, uh, for this one. You're you're stuck with the B plus team. This is like the was well, like the A team is sound speed Cabral and Lightning Rapid, and like the the B team is like the other group, and then this is like the C team. We're, we're like we're the Q team. <laughs> okay, so anyway, chapter eight, uh, three me school society cupcakes versus muffins. I'll be playing the o the OCs. Uh, Zombie will be narrating, and Nero will be taking the place of the canned characters. And as always, <laughs> oh, my conscience <laughs> kill writes in brackets and bold. My conscience joy writes in these in italics. I, I respond in these. Oh. Actually, I, 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 I'm trying to... Okay, I don't remember what his voice is. Sorry. I'll, I'll do it from here on out. Uh, I didn't even know how I got out... got here. But I was on my bed, ditzy lying on top of me, as our lips locked into each other, playing around and having a special moment. I blinked my eyes slowly at her. I love you. Oh yeah, he was uh, he was the uh, protagonist of Ghost House. <laughs> yes. I love you too, Cupcake. She replied, Wait, Cupcake. My eyes slowly opened and stared at the horror before me, as I was in shock. Pinkie Pie, get off of me! How did you even get in here? I shouted. Oh, come on. Who leaves their door locked? We're just gonna have a little fun. Pinky. Now, this is a quote from the story here. Pinky flirted. I, I I believe her name is now Kinky Pie. Anyway. Well, I'm thinking that's not really a flirt, is it? No, not really. Not really. Come on, who that's... leaves door locked? Yeah, oh, we're just gonna on. have a little fun. I, I imagine in the author's mind, this is flirting. This is like some some <laughs> lighthearted banter. His <laughs> idea of flirting is just like, hey, my basement's open. I tried moving my legs, both fore and hind. I was restrained oh my God. to the fucking bed. What the fuck was happening? Well, apparently you're restrained. Oh, don't, to the bed. don't escape. We all know you have a thing for me since that. <laughs> I went ditchy, my kid. And she's my my friend. Get off, please. Help, anyone. Rape. Again. For a second Actually, time. <laughs> second time works better than the first. I really didn't want to screw this up, but I needed help from someone, and I didn't want to get raped. I don't want to screw up my friendship, goal. but on the other hand, I really don't want to be raped. What to do? <laughs> Decisions. Decisions. Where the fuck was Kill and Joy when I needed them? I glanced over my shoulders at their usual spot. Are Wait, you have they freaking... established that they're normally on his shoulders? Yeah, kind of, and then we've also established that for some reason, his his the alt, his alternate personalities have a sexual relationship with the person who keeps trying to rape him, which is possibly the most fucked up, you know, psychological bit of madness I've ever seen in a fan fiction. His his, his psychological disorder. Is sexually involved with another person's psychological disorder. <laughs> yeah, but well, this it speaks volumes about his bizarre relationship with Pinkie Pie, where like his mental projections are busy fucking her while he's like, "No, 
No, fuck you, I have a girlfriend. Like, in, a, in the hands of a better yeah. writer, this could be, like, a weirdly dark and interesting, you know, like, character study. As it is, it's just mm. stupid and immature. Yeah. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, let's see here. Are you fucking kidding me? Kill was too busy having fun with Pink Amina, and so was Joy with Surprise. Okay, I wasn't going to lie, but they fell... Sorry. Okay, I wasn't going to lie, but they fell for that trick because I always did have a sort of thing for Pinky, but not anymore until I had Ditsy. Not anymore until I had Ditsy, then I had a thing for Pinky again. <laughs> that sentence is horrible. <laughs> yeah. No punctuation. I don't even know starts and where it ends. Uh, well, speaking of starts and where it ends, Nero, you're up. No, I'm just gonna fuck you. No kidding. She said with a laugh. <laughs> you and I are going to do what they are. <laughs> As she pointed to our conferences. We are, we are going to do mental issues. This is, oh god, this is like Babu's first porno. And then we will do what they are. Here is the visual aid. <laughs> oh lord. Alright. Do you have your line? Yeah, sorry, I'm just trying to find it. Um, uh, oh fuck! My it sideways! Is. Oh wait, no. Um, no, it's like, okay, yeah. Uh, oh fuck me sideways. Oh fuck me sideways! Wait, no doubt! I said, <laughs> metaphorically, coming into realization what I said. Like, this is really not the time to make a joke, unless you are, like, the unhidden god of comedy, then... No. Piggy, if you do this now, joke, I swear, I will never talk to you again. I will burn all bridges between you and me. She looked at me with a smile. Oh, Celestia. No, she was moving down my chest. Knock, knock. knock, knock the door's real. Great. That's everything all right. Thank you, Celestia. Ditty had made her morning visit to Yo, me wanting to get breakfast. Open the door. Open the door. Oh, Open wait, the door. Yeah, no, it's, it's poorly it's punctuated. Just... Open Even the you door. Are... Even the narrator wants her to open the door. Yeah. <laughs> I shouted impatiently. Oh, it's locked. No one's getting in. Pinky said. Who is that? Who, who is that inside? Can't inside. It's locked. Ditsy shouted, tugging at the door. Kick the fucking door in. I ordered. Do it, you bitch. Thud. Thud. It's not working. I'm gonna call Sea Breeze. Uh, yeah. What you got here is a locked door. I'm gonna I'm gonna call in some people to help out. You just uh, stick put there. We'll be right back. <laughs> no wait. Don't leave me here. Oh fuck. Why? Oh god. Oh no. I just read that. <laughs> Looks like we have some more time together. Pinky said with a hint of drunk. I examined her carefully. Her face, her expression. She looked a bit drunk, which might have caused her so, which might have caused her sober thoughts and a question. And a question. What is that line? What the fuck? I examined her carefully. Her face, her expression. She looked a bit drunk, which might have caused her sober thoughts and a question. Wait, wait, so the fact that she's drunk caused her to have the thoughts that she would have if she were sober and just a completely unrelated question. I think the idea, which is also kind of fucked up, is the idea is like, oh, wait, it's not Pinky's fault. She's she's drunk. She's like trying to rape me because of her drunken state. She's It's fine. Even more, she looked a bit drunk. Who in hell gets drunk this early? Rang. Rang. 
an alarm clock went off. Oh boy, 3 a.m. 8 o'clock. Woohoo! It's always happy hour. Mary Punch said happily as she pulled out her favorite wine and drank it from the bottle. That Andrew. that is literally the oh boy it's three a.m. joke. Yeah, it is literally it is just a literally. SpongeBob joke. It is literally a SpongeBob joke sandwiched in the middle of this rape scene. And <laughs> it, of course, you have to make it booze to make it funnier. Oh god! Now I'm just imagining the squeal. I, I wish that this was like one of those shows where they actually had like insert jokes and stuff because I could I could absolutely like see myself just finding a clip of that like squeal like a pig scene. And then just like intercutting right in the middle of it, like the oh boy, it's three a.m. Oh, all oh. oh, right. Transition back to the rape. <laughs> That's where rape already in progress. <laughs> okay, I got sea breeze. Just hold on a second. Stay back from the door. He was trying to communicate with me through the door. Oh my god, no. really? I'm not by the door. I'm tied to the Celestia damn bed. I shouted, horrified, thinking what was going to happen. Uh, okay. What? How? Seabreeze exclaimed. Obviously, I tied my fucking self to the bed. I shouted with sarcasm. Ghosts can be so stupid sometimes. I will explain later. Just get me out of this quick. Pinky was growing impatient that I wasn't cooperating and worried that she was going to get caught. She shared one quick French kiss with me. Thud. And with that, the door flew out of its hinges from Seabreeze's powerful kick. Wait, d See. W with the, with the French kiss or the thud, <laughs> the door flew out. Yeah, true. <laughs> it's kind of, you just kind of th threw onomatopoeia in there. It is confusing. I demand explanations. Seabreeze and Ditsy rushed to my aid, but Pinky was gone, as if she vanished completely in thin air. What? How? Such a lust for rape. Who? <laughs> how, how, how is this freaking possible? I shouted. They watched me restrained and tied to my bed, confused on how it happened. I gave up trying to make a reasonable explanation, but it was Pinkie Pie. No such explanation ever existed. It just happens. Like, you know, I'm, I'm actually kind of curious as to how this guy Sorry, looked at no. Pinkie Pie and immediately thought, "Is she be a crazy rapist?" I'd see that. Yeah, bro, shit just happens. Just like how you, like how you uh, messed up my time with Pink Amina. And my and Miss Surprise. Don't worry, we're going to pay Pinky a visit soon. So, what about this fetish you have here? Seabreeze asked. Do you like this, Grace? Because I can tie you down to my bed. Ditsy said, interested in what was happening. And I... S oh, sorry. And, and I, I swore I heard Pinky's voice. You did, Ditsy, and it's not my fetish. I said calmly. Just give me the fuck out! Scratch that last statement. Hey guys, what's all the commotion about? I heard some screaming in. Vinyl spoke as both herself and Octavia walked in, pausing at the side of me tied to my bed. Ooh, Ditsy, you dirty villain, you. Vinyl <laughs> said. What? We found them like this. Ditsy was trying to clear her name. Oh, this wacky situation. <laughs> Individual <laughs> work. situation. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, you ponies and your strange fetishes. Octavia had now put her unwanted two cents in. 
I'm all right. That's what I said. Oh, poor Nero. All these voices. <laughs> Breeze added. By the way, guys, I am a voice actor for hire. If you haven't noticed, I hadn't. <laughs> stumbled in the site before. So, uh, uh Lyra and Bonbon bon stumbled in and saw the site before. So, uh, what is it now? We uh, all take in turns with grace. Hey, Lyra said. I obviously didn't need this right now. <laughs> oh, it's so hilarious because he's currently tied up and being raped. <laughs> Let's all gawk. <laughs> Whoa, Mr. Killjoy. The awkward, and the awkward tension is so tight. You can now fuck it. <laughs> this is strange. I've read this one before. Yeah. That is strangely and horrifyingly true. <laughs> I yeah, I like this. All seems this all seems like super very... familiar. I mean, like, yeah, like side just on top of me. Hold on, shush, shush, dog face. I know I need your two cents on this matter. Turns okay, out, okay. Be... Uh... Yeah, be like... I, I, I think you guys just like skipped the previous chapter for the fact that you didn't have all the living the dream guys oh together. Oh my god, you might be right. right. Oh my god, you might be right. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> this all just seems This too is super familiar. Oh my god, oh my god. The egg on my face is gonna be super real. Hold on. Hold on, let's read. Let's read playlists. There's 98 videos in here. Let's read! Hold on. Hands. <laughs> Live in the dream. Lord. Three of me crossover part one two. No, I'm just seeing chapter seven here, but wait. <gasps> no. <laughs> oh my god, I labeled this chapter seven because there's a fucking guy skipped the crossover! Oh my god, I didn't mark the crossover as chapter 7, so that was chapter 8! Oh, fuck! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh my god! Wobble love a dum dum Oh my god, this is the worst! Good thing I, I brought it up. <laughs> I, I, felt, I felt like I should bring it up, but I was just like, nah, it's probably just me. I've been listening to too much Let's Read lately. Just, oh my god. You oh just kept getting god. more from Okay. All right. So the, the only question is now: do, do we upload this, or do we just scrap it and move on to chapter eight? <laughs> Let, let's upload this as like a separate. <laughs> <laughs> okay, people, you heard that. This has been a special edition of Let's Read. Where are we going over the show we've already read? Well, at least now we remember what happened a year ago. Everybody caught up now? <laughs> <laughs>